today's conversation. Good morning. Yeah, we are still on the, the issue of uh, this rivalry, bigotry, and also what we are experiencing in Nigeria today. What we have to do with the ego outside Yoruba. Now the question is, what is what is going on? What is going on? Um, thanks for having me. Good morning once again, all our viewers. Yesterday I made them, um, you know, it is from the heart that the mouth speaked. I've been thinking about it. I said it yesterday. I didn't want, I didn't even plan to say it, but then I don't know that um, on my birthday I'm I'm, I'm I, I, I'll be adorning the Isabu dress. Even I've been planning such for a long time, but. The reason why I now made it intentional, I, I must do it this year, was because of this LP saga. You know, you know, it's a, it's, it's a very, very sad development. I almost, I almost, I almost, I almost shed tears that a man is putting Nigeria's image into 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 a very good use. It's making Nigeria, who's supposed to be the end of Africa, truly the end of Africa. The man has his own private business, which is LPs. Then he decided. Okay, let my uh, hostess and air crew let them adorn a particular dress of, a, of his own of his own tribe. And the next thing you see is to see so-called educated people. Now, I've only said that them um, education without exposure is equal to ignorance, and education without wisdom is equal to waste of time and resources. If you are educated, something is not in your brain. Then what is the sense of education? Then instead of you to look at the bright side that different airways are going to slash their prices, British Air, Virgin Atlantic, even Turkish um, air. But yes, we are only looking at the side of wearing just um, wearing the, the traditional outfit. It's not supposed to be so. I gave an example of how Emirates airline for people that fly. You see how they you see how they dress. People that ask now see them, the Emirates see them. You see how those those ladies dress. Etihad belong to Dubai. You see how they dress. Qatar Airways belongs to the people of Qatar. They dress in their traditional attires. Indian home, that one is even more visible. If you watch Indian movies, they like that. Then a Nigerian indigenous um, man, he owns an airway. Okay, now let me let me let me dress in in the, in the attire of my own people, and then all, all, you, all, all, all you can see is um, is big You understand? You see, let me give you an example. If somebody, if somebody is fighting with you and started spilling some words, for example, I will kill you. I will enjoy you. I will do something. It's not the fight that made that person to, 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 to say those things. That person has already had that evil intention in heart. So you can see that they have already hated the man. They just waiting for an opportunity. And you can see that is a result of jealousy from, from the one that is in the just anyway. Where is it today? You saw how last um, election minister said they will unveil an airway which belongs to Nigeria. What has become of the airway? Nothing. You understand? So a man now that has put in a job in the in the in, in, in that giving a job a good name, putting a job on the map, but having his home airways and I don't need and in a job in digital because this is why people they like they like to see something like that. Oh, which time they say Igbo, no problem. Tomorrow he can decide. Uh also next week can do but you have to start on his own. Uh, the man is not a foolish man. Do you expect him to start and Igbo man now start in Yoruba? No now. No, we see, we, we see. and by the way, tomorrow I've already list, I've unveiled it again. Five of nine top members of that APC, they belong to Yoruba, my my my, my, my language. They are Yoruba in APC. Okay, take a look at this. In the other companies that belong to either uh, Aousa Fulani or Yoruba people, how many of them have top members that belong to other tribes? You know what I'm So look at it from this angle again. But all I can see is so is is jealousy, jealousy, hatred, and that envy. Why would you ask? Why would you someone that is that is putting a guy on a map? You understand? So these are what I, 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 I've only been speaking about. If this guy is the problem, if I, I don't this guy, take me to court. If I don't this guy, why report to police? Because it's my right to 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 wear to to wear to, to, to wear any any coat I like. At least for now, he said you're in Nigeria. You understand? Eh, I saw you in Nigeria. Even in Nigeria, man, can start to to dress in a Chinese attire. You can start to dress in Indian attire. But we are still in this country. And somebody uh, somebody made the same. Is um, employed to dress in his own native attire. Are you angry about it? What is the problem? Where is all this is coming from? Where, where is this? this so, if somebody is progressing, I've always said, go and ask that person. Don't be jealous of the person. Go and ask the person, how are you doing it? Then you can learn one or two from it. But you can't be jealous of the person. Let me give an example of the of the of 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 someone that I know of the of the reason why I like the ego spirit. 
The man had the shop in Abuja. They demolished the shop, FCTA. Then, now the man came to Lagos again. He, he, he put all the things together. He had the shop then in Arifo Oshie Keja. Lagos government, they said it was all this illegal or something. They demolished the man's shop. That man could have given up and said it's over. The man said also today now the man has different shops. So that is the spirit. So you can so such a man. You have to go close to him and ask questions. What is driving you? What is behind the spirit? That's kind of place that I am. I don't get jealous of you. I don't. I don't. I'm not jealous. I am happy to see people go for. So I'll go and ask a question, sir. How are you doing this? But no, all you can do is to be jealous of somebody that has his own, 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 his own company. So this is the problem. Until we address these things, we can't be, we can't be running away from it. There's a, the, the conspiracy is very, very clear. You understand? Look at Asai Dokubo yesterday. Somebody asked me that. Um, what should the go group do with him? Simple. If I were, you have to, it's your son. You must accept him. But accept him, accept him with one hand. Because before he made it, now he's making this statement not because he loves the goals. No. Not because, you see, we all know the truth in this country. But we can try to lie and to, and to, and, and, and to play games. Somebody from give us say uh, I'm not a Negro because of the civil war that they are trying to divide you, divide our who they call it. And you can't think about it and say, I know I'm coming from here, he's still I'm not a Negro man no more. You can't think. So now, as I said the Fugo said, now uh, Calabaya, I am a Negro person now. He remembers before the election, I always tell people be on Twitter. That is where things are happening in this country. If you are on Twitter, you know what is happening. The man is the Negroes before the election. That is possible you can send them as slaves. He said it. The video is there. But now, the same man now is not saying that he's an ego. Why? What is his spirit behind this? His spirit is that he has been sidelined. Maybe he was probably something by this, this government. Now, he now remembers that, oh, let me go back to my roots. Do you understand? So, this is so no, this is it. So, the people, they should accept it. And they should accept him with one, one hand. The other hand, now, they should be looking at him. Because tomorrow, if they call him to Abuja, that same man will still come to attack his heritage. It's an ego. You can't, you can't, you can't deny, you can't see, you can't deny who you are. You can play politics, you can deceive yourself. But you can't deny, you all know where, everybody knows, for example, where, where your shit comes from. You understand? I've always been part of, oh, I'm an ego person. I'm a, I can't because I'm accepting something and, and I'll tell myself, I'm from Lagos. Oh, uh, my family, said, yes, I was born in Lagos, for example. I'm an ego person. So you should, should be proud of where you are, where you come from. So the man knew that he's an ego man. But because of politics and everything, he he he, he, he insults them. Now that he, he, maybe he has eaten breakfast now, he's now going back to ah uh, uh, I cannot deny myself, I cannot deny my family, I cannot. You have been denying them for a very very long time. Okay, don't, these people that are carrying out this uh, jealousy by God, you don't they know that uh, if you are going to stop an evil man in Nigeria, it will it will not. Uh, uh, all go well for the country. No, it's got, no, it's, it's, got, it's got all go well. I, 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 I've already made the best, and it's a, and, and, and it is the I've been see. God knows I'm, I'm here standing here, and I'm saying the truth here. I believe in what Jesus says in John eight verse twenty two that you, you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. I've been making that statement every day. But that's my favorite verse in the Bible. Nothing can prevail over the truth. No matter how gross darkness is, if you put on the light, that darkness will run away. When you say the truth, no matter how the lies have become, I have an advice on the egos. I will stay here, but then I will, I will elaborate it tomorrow. But before I go there, no matter how you try to hide the truth, the truth will come out in its true form. You can't hide the truth. Let me give you an example. There was a fight then in Fagba between Yorubas and and Aosabi. You know, I've been saying it consistently here. Consistent. I've been. I don't. I don't. I, I don't just wake up today and change. No, I've been saying because I said. Until the people of the south see themselves as one first, yes, you can, I you can go to different ways, but in Nigeria, yes, first, south should be one. But on the north, even though they have different types in north, you see themselves as one. If the south, see, if they are one, we can achieve great, great things. But you see, my my people, even some people will say, hey, No, we are not one, uh, those are my enemies, are my enemies. Then when that fight happened in, in was it 2000, 2021, that 20, then in fact, then and also your woman has said, ah, I'm going to support you. We're 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 going to support you. We
I don't know why they are useless people. I said you are a foolish person. Now you can now make this statement. But this is what I've been saying Yeah. But you only said no or say they are evil people. But now you know remember that they are your brothers because other people are killing you. Have you ever heard at any time that there is a fight between the Obas and the Ibos? I've been saying it. Even in, 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 in South West or South East, that a time came in Nigeria history. I'm talking about the civil wars like Nigeria war versus Igbos. I'm talking about inter-tribal war between the Obas and Igbos. Tell me, let somebody, let, let somebody tell me a comment. It has never happened. They can't fight. They won't fight. You understand? Because they, they believe in sanctity of human life. They believe in education. They believe in business. They, this one, they can't fight for God. If an Igbo man sits down and you insult Jesus in front of an Igbo man, he will look at you and go. If a Obama is a Muslim, you insult Muhammad, you can go. If it's a Christian, you insult Jesus, you can go. But you can't do that in the north. You dare not. You understand? So until first things we have been saying in the south, Nigeria is still one. The south is still the same as one. But the way that have been sponsored, those are the problem. You know them. Even, you know, even people that are watching, they know them. They see, they see, they, they hear them when they talk. It is, it, 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 it is a sponsored target against the ego. Obi took thought. Obi took thought. According to INEC. In the morning, Obi, 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 Obi. In the afternoon, Obi, 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 Obi. In the evening, Obi, Obi. What does that tell people that have common sense? So people are not telling that Obi should give us a solution to Nigeria's problem. And he took third. Okay, it wasn't that I took second. I don't know if I heard them call his name. I think there's something. There's something yeah, so they're see, not telling see, us. You see, see, thank God for, thank God for, thank God for salvation in Christ. In 2016, I gave my life to Christ, and and I thank God that I've been able to have some insight to the Word of God. I don't worship any pastor. I worship God. So so I read my Bible. And I understand God. I'm thank God. The wisdom of God is coming, and I and I thank God for it. There are some things that when they tell you. It is more. It 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 it, it, it is it, it it is way more than what you can see. Only wisdom of God can tell you. I was telling that man that day. Eh, okay, go be no. Eh, go be just your one. Go be just one. Ah, Baba. So be the president. Eh, I'm about. I say so you know. So they know. You understand? Know, see, in your heart you know. I I give, I give that example. I said, if if somebody kept something and you and maybe another person steal it, the person now says, I'm going to steal my something. So something will happen to the person. If he does steal it in his mind, he'll be judging him. Ah, yeah. I missed it. He might not want to come out openly. But in, my, in his mind, ah, I missed it this thing. That is it. They knew who won the election. They knew. We, we know. But even if they knew. But since they are going to them, you know, they are the They are another person. That's why that name must keep coming. Let me give you an example. I was in the bus one day. Then we were going, we were going to Ikeja. Then the bus almost crashed. Then I saw the, that was on a Friday. A Muslim woman, Jesus, Jesus, he was calling the name of Jesus. Then, me as a former Muslim, when I told her that the name of Jesus cannot work for you that does not believe in him, you must be saved for, the, for, it, for, for, for Jesus to work for you. The person I said that I know that Jesus Christ is powerful. He is a Muslim. He said, Mom, Mom, Jesus is my brother. I know that Jesus is powerful, but. You understand? So you know, they know, they knew that this man is the person. But they have so that's why you see, Obi, 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 Igbo, Igbo, Igbo. If your mama does something, he can go free. Our some man, maybe he can go free. But another man does it. So what, what's your what's your advice to those that are making Yoruba look like as if they are bad people? And that is why people like us are coming out. You understand? And, and no, I, I saw the comments. Of many people even knew. You know, because before they say all oh, you must are like this, but they, they knew that during the last election they saw how we came out of Peter Obi now. I told you how Peter Obi won in Ali Monsho. That's the strongest hold of APC. You can verify it any day, any time. In Ali Monsho, if for example, in my side in Osho the Solo, there are more there are Igbos there. In in Alaba, there are Igbos. For example, in 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 the Jibonosa, there are Igbos. As Peter Obi won there, they must say because they are Igbos. But Ali Monsho is the Core strength of APC. Where there are many Yorubas. I mentioned those places. There's Agbado, Okeodo, there's um, Yanokpaja. All those sides are uh, Alimosho. That's the biggest government in Nigeria by population. It will be warm in that place. What does that tell you? Many Yorubas voted for him. You understand? You say, oh, Mr. Macaroni, oh, Faz. 
saw how AY, that my AY, that your mouth So many of them, they came out of it. I'll be. You understand? So, we, so, 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 but there are some, there are some elements that are being paid. They're not doing it for, they're not doing it for free. They are being paid to, to, to propagate hatred against the Bota. It is deliberate. They are being paid. They are being sponsored. That's why some of us are not calling them out. Go on Twitter and see how we are tackling them. We are tackling them now so that they won't spoil our name. You can't speak for me. Nobody can speak for me. I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been 13, I've been called different names. It's 2011. When I, when I voted for Gulo Jonathan. And since then, I've been, you understand? So this is the advice of the boss. I'll speak more about it tomorrow. Let them invest in media. The people, I'm talking about newspapers. Majority of newspapers belongs to the Yobas and people of Edo State. The one that belongs to the Igbo man, I don't want to mention the name of the newspaper, they know it. Even it too is in the is in the other party. So even he cannot defend his, his, his people. Yes, and what those international communities, what they see on the newspaper is what they believe. So the Igbo people they are blessed in business, good. But they should not invest in media. So that they cannot write their own stories very well. So that you know, if another man writes a story for you, they may be lies. They may be propaganda. But when you write your stories, yourself, I'll speak more about it tomorrow. When you write about your own story by your own self, then those dead people will see you for who you truly are. Because in everything, you don't know you, 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 you don't know how, what you face as a child. That's why even tomorrow, they are still putting it in, in the mind of those little children. Those lies are propaganda. Those are they, 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 they always do rituals. They hit one flesh. You go people, they, their business is not pure. They do. They told us, but thank God when we grieve ourselves, we can see that no, these things are lies. Thank God for it. But they are still telling little children. But if they have their own media, they can write about themselves. This is how good people are asking about. When you adore it with your white chest. This is my this is my tradition. This is my tribe. And I've already said it that until everybody in Nigeria vote the way the people of the South South and the South is vote. It's only the people not the South South the people's vote. Nigeria cannot go forward. Since 1999, the people have been voting for the right candidate. Oh no. If yes now, at least for, for a better candidate. Abbas Anjo did well. At least we are in Nigeria. They voted for Abbas was in Obama. They voted for Obama. They voted for the full animal. You know that South South. They voted for Atiku. Other people voted for because of the conspiracy against Jonathan. They voted against Jonathan. They voted for other people voted for Buhari, South West and the North against against Jonathan. Look how Buhari, look, look how Buhari made Nigeria. Now in 2019, even they voted for Atiku again. In the of South West again voted for Buhari again. Second term. That's what that's how the job that's how the situation began. Then 2023 again, now with their own son, who is not, not even because he's our son, because he's, he's, he's competent, he has character, he has capacity with commitment, that's forces, competence, character, capacity, and commitment. Force, you must have it to be a good leader. I mean, that has it. They voted for him now, and I voted for their own. This is where we find ourselves. So let everybody have that, that, that business mindset. Of the ghost that never say die, that believe in God attitude of the ghost, then we can expect to see Nigeria to go forward. But without that, you are sitting on a tripod, you remove one tire, it cannot work. If you marginalize the ghost as you continue to do, Nigeria can't move forward. That is the fact. God bless all obedience. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much. God bless you.